Hey, what's going on guys? Chris here from Filled Inventory, bringing you another Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. Uh, we are where we left off here, right outside of the wonderful Mount Moon tunnel entrance. Here we go. Um, so, a couple things. Uh, I know it's been a while since I posted this gameplay. I think it's been like a week or two. Uh, I've just been busy with, uh, work and stuff, and, um, TM9, Bullet Seed, nice. Um, busy with work or whatever, and, I don't know, I was kind of just being lazy and didn't feel like recording anything, plus I was playing, uh, I was getting back into Call of Duty and stuff, and, um, Suspicious men are in the cave, what about you? And, um, since, oop, and of course forgot to turn my phone off, but, um, and since I, uh, beat Bioshock Infinite, and there really isn't a game coming, another new game coming out for a long time, or for a while, at least I can think of that I want to play, um, I re-signed up for Gamefly, so I got, um, Spec Ops the line from there. I was playing that. Um, so that's why there hasn't been videos for, you know, like a week or two. But, um, I'm going to record a bunch, so I'll just have a bunch saved, and then I can just upload them in case something like that ever happens again. So, you know, when I'm in the mood to play the, like, the way I was doing it before was I would just play, uh, this for like a half hour for the recording and then that was it but um what I'm gonna do now is just play till I don't feel like playing anymore record all of it and then that way I'll have you know a couple episodes per recording session and if like I said it happens again where I'm just lazy or don't feel like doing it um I'll have videos that I can at least post and you won't have to wait, you know, a week or two to get another video, so. But, yeah. So. Uh, so we're fighting a Weedle here. Bug Catcher Trainer. He poisoned my Metapod, of course. <clears throat> All I need is one more level. My Metapod will evolve. And then you can start getting decent moves. Oh, nice. Good. Cure my poison problem. So, I am debating, like I said, I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty and stuff, um, I probably wouldn't do videos for that, because I'm already a master prestige or whatever, and, I mean, maybe if I just got good gameplays or whatever, but, <coughs> <laughs> since, you know, I'm playing, I'm doing a Let's Play, like, Pokemon right now, um, Let's see, real quick, if I have anything to heal him, probably not. Nope. Figured. Um, since like I'm doing a Let's Play Pokemon, I, um, I was debating picking up a capture card, and, um, because, like, I just got a, picked up a GameCube the other day, because I wanted to go back and play some old GameCube games, um, a lot of people hate on the GameCube, which I really don't understand because GameCube is probably one of my favorite systems, if not my favorite. Uh, just like the games on there. Now don't get me wrong, I'm not like a Nintendo fanboy or anything. I hate Nintendo now. Like, they're freaking... <laughs> the Wii U's a joke. Like, I don't know what the hell they're doing with themselves. But, um... Some of like, my favorite games are on there, like Pikmin and... Uh, <laughs> um, Wind Waker. I know everybody hates Wind Waker. I don't know why. Wind Waker is probably my favorite Zelda game. Um, Twilight Princess was on there at the end. Luigi's Mansion, Mario Sunshine, all these games that I loved when I was a kid. But, um, so I was thinking of maybe getting a capture card and doing Let's Plays of some of those older games like a Pikmin or something like that. Um, not sure yet, I'm still debating on it, but, uh, 
you know, depending on the response of this Let's Play, I guess that'll dictate that, but, you know, if that's something you guys want to see, let me know. I mean, I, I would be down for it. For my friends to find me here. Um, <coughs> I'd be down for it, because like I said, I mean, if I'm going to go back and play um, those old games anyway, you know, might as well record them and stuff, like, it'd be cool. I, uh, I already went back and actually started playing a little Pikmin the other day. I forgot how much I love the game. The game's awesome. But, uh, that's beside the point, but, um, yeah, so like I said, I mean, maybe I'll do that, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. You know, leave a comment in the comments below and let me know what you think. Like I said, I mean, obviously, if no one gives a crap and no one watches these videos anyway, then it really wouldn't be worth my time, but, you know, I feel like I've got a decent amount of views on this so far for not having a lot of subscribers on this channel yet, so, I mean, I figured why not, but, like I said, we'll see, I guess. Uh, this is gonna kill my Beedrill. Because he's still pretty weak. Uh, the other thing is, you probably noticed in my videos. Sorry for this cough. Like I've been coughing in probably all my videos. Um, I don't know what the hell's wrong with me. I've had this cough for about a month and a half now. Um, kinda too lazy to go to the doctor. I guess you'll notice that's a theme with me. Is I'm just lazy to do things, but, um, I, uh, I don't know, I haven't been to the doctor since I was, like, 18, I'm 25 now, so, I mean, that gives you a, uh, an idea, like, I never get sick, and, like, I don't know, I don't, I don't feel sick, I just have a cough, like, that's a, like, I don't feel, I don't feel crappy or anything, or I don't feel, like, tired, I don't feel nauseous or whatever, so, I don't know, I've kind of just been, like, um, well, I just realized, I've been walking around here, I didn't even wear any of these, was, eh, the 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 I said, I was just running around, and I forgot, I totally, totally forgot I had the running shoes, um, but, yeah, like I was saying, uh, I feel fine, I just had this call for, like, a month and a half, I don't know, I should probably go to the doctor soon, but, whatever, but, uh, yeah, just wanted to apologize for you guys having to hear me cough every now and then in these videos. Since, uh, you know. You know, that's how it is. Uh, so here we go, back to our moon. Oh, first wild Pokemon here. Zubat, shocker. I knew that was going to happen. I don't have a Zubat yet. I could have sworn I got a Zubat. Uh, boo. Well, let's see. Um, kind of want to run. Thank you. I really get a male Zubat. I could have sworn I saw Dory when I was running back. I guess I'm going crazy. Oh, a Clefairy. I know these are rare. <coughs> so I guess we'll try to catch this guy. Or this girl, excuse me. The next one I met about it wasn't so freaking weak and did more damage. Uh God, it's so weak. Come on, Metapod, do get a critical hit in here or something. Get some crits hits. <sighs> but yeah, I guess uh, back to what I was saying about, you know, I reset up with my game fly because it kind of sucked because I can't, uh, 
I really can't think of any games that are coming out in like the near future at least. I mean closest thing I can think that's coming out is like GTA, whatever that's supposed to come out in like September. Like from now until September I legit can't think of a game that's coming out. <laughs> like anything new that's supposed to be good. Um because yeah, like GTA, new Assassin's Creed the new Batman they announced, obviously new Call of Duty, stuff like that. That doesn't come out till like, September, October, November. So, what am I supposed to play from freaking, uh, from now until then? kind of sucks. That's why I, uh, signed up for Gamefly again. Because there's a couple games that came out, uh, recently that I wanted to try that I just, I don't know if I'd like enough to buy them. So, um, oh, Clefairy's data. Clefairy, mountain Pokemon. With its magical and cute appeal, it has many admirers. It is rare and found only in certain areas. Nice. Nope, oh, no nickname. <coughs> um, but yeah, I wanted to play the, uh, the new Tomb Raider that was supposedly supposed to be good. And, um, Far Cry. I really wanted to play Far Cry. That was supposed to be really good. Oh, God, why can't I escape from Zubats? There's Zubats for crying out loud. I don't understand. Uh, why? Um. And, then, like, I'm a big. Not, like, big, I guess. I mean. My two favorite video game franchises prior Mass Effect and. Well. Three, I guess, would be Mass Effect, Dead Space, Kingdom Hearts. But, um, what I was going to say was, is, uh, I'm a pretty big, decent Gears of Wars fan. Like, I have the, uh, the, uh, Gears of War console or whatever. When that came out, I got that. And then the, um, you know, I bought, like, the Epic Edition or whatever it was, a Gears 3, like, the $150 one. Um,. And Gears of War Judgment came out, and I don't know, I'm just not, I'm just kind of like, meh, about it. So, I put it on my, oh boy, um, what, don't sneak up on me, I, uh, put it on my Gamefly, because, like I said, I mean, I'm not, kind of meh about it, I really don't want to, I just have no desire to go spend the $60 or whatever it is to pick it up. I'd rather just rent it and play through it. Because I've never been a big fan on um, Gears multiplayer either. I've only played the... Uh, I've tried it a couple times, but I don't know. It's just too, like... I don't know. I really can't explain it, but it's just, like, too, like... <laughs> I hate just freaking doing that stupid roll and shotgunning. That's like all it is. Like, I don't know. But, um... So I usually only play the campaign, so it's like not even worth it to go buy it for 60 bucks and play, you know, the 8-hour campaign or whatever it is. I'll just run it, like... Plus, like I said, I'm not even that, like... excited about it just because it's like a prequel, and I don't know. I honestly... I know they said they chose to do Baird, because apparently Baird's a fan favorite. I fucking hate Baird. I don't know who the hell likes Baird. I hate Baird. You know, if it was a, if it was a straight up a Cole game, fine, that's cool. Uh, if it was Dom, cool. I hate Baird. I think Baird is the biggest fucking douche on the planet, and I cannot stand him. He, like... Like I say, I can't stand him. <laughs> like, he's okay, but he's fucking annoying. Like, he's not... I was never, in my time of playing Gears 1, 2, and 3, I was never like, Yeah, I, c I would love if they made a game where I got to play as Baird. I, I never... Never once thought that in my mind playing through the Gears trilogy. Never, ever wished that I could play as Baird. But, uh, I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Apparently, I mean, apparently it's just me, because Baird's apparent was apparently such a popular fan favorite that that's why they made him the, uh, 
the main character of this game. So, I don't know. I guess I'm just an idiot, but whatever. <sighs> Alright, so, yep. Yeah, I guess we'll get off that topic and back on the topic at hand of Pokemon here. Yes, Metapod finally freaking gets level 10 will evolve. I defeat Super Premier Joven. My Pokemon won't do. Yep, they suck. Yeah, Metapod's evolving. Woo! My Metapod evolved into a Butterfree. Okay, what do I got over here? Potion! Use that since I'm not about one's about to die. Hold on, Pokemon's about to die. Not a couple, but <coughs> like two of them. Oh, oh no, I healed Mankey before, yeah. What? Oh, I forgot this that stupid shows you now. <laughs> So what the hell is happening to Butterfree? Ooh, rare candy! Yes! Oh, rare candies, how I love you. How I miss you. Um, who do I want to level up? Do I, who do I want to level up here? Let's go Butterfree, why not? Yeah, eat that rare candy. Okay, so since I gave that to my Butterfree, we'll switch her with Ratata. Okay. Ah. <sighs> I really need to buy some freaking. Um, whatchamacallum? Freaking. Wow, why can't I think of the name now? Uh. Oh, Repels. Yeah, that's it. I really need to buy some Repels. You need to go through this cave to get ruling city. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I really need to buy some repels. It's kind of... I hate... I just don't want to keep fighting... Zubats for no reason. Uh, that was retarded. That's my iPad Jurassic Park game app going off for no reason I can imagine. <laughs> it just goes off randomly sometimes. Kind of... It's honestly scared me before. I've been, like, laying in bed about to sleep at, like... 3 o'clock in the morning and all of a sudden like the T-Rex roars. I'm like, really? And it's always some stupid. It's like, hey, just so you know, 10% off if you want to buy gold for your park. Some stupid thing like that. I'm like, really? I'm like, leave me alone. Nice, retired agree to level 11. Yeah, I'm going to put my Pidgey in make my life a lot easier here. Okay, Gust, get this over with. Oh, I think Pidgey Ball's at 16, I believe, right? Yeah. One more level after this, and then I'll, I'll get my Pidgeotto. Pretty awesome. Metapod, nope, I will keep my Pidgey. I lost. Yes, you did. Sorry, bug catcher boy. Um. God, it's been so long since I played this. I legit don't remember where to go in here. I'm not even gonna bother catching a Zubat right now, honestly, because I can catch them anywhere, and I'm sure I'll find a much higher level one eventually. Plus, I'm I'm not going to use it, so. Hi, I'm Escaping Frost here under Mount Moon. Sometimes Brock or Peter Jim lends me a hand. Okay. Um, but yeah, like I said, like, I'm never gonna use it. <laughs> like, Geodude. Didn't I catch a Geodude? Yeah, I know I have a Geodude. The, yeah, I thought I was supposed to show the little Pokeball up by their... Oh, maybe it doesn't do it with the sex? I don't know. I could have sworn that if you caught the Pokemon, hey... 
Wow, it's way bigger in here than I thought. Um, I thought if you caught the Pokemon, it's supposed to have a little Pokeball up there. And it wasn't showing you for Geodude. And I'm like 99% sure that we caught a Geodude, didn't we? I mean, <laughs> unless I legit don't remember because it's been that long since I played it. But, <coughs> excuse me, I could have sworn we caught a Geodude. I'm going to send my Char or Charmander make this a lot easier. Oh, my evasiveness. Ah, oh, dang it. I hate when I push the button too fast. Could have killed him in one hit probably with Ember, but whatever. Whatever, I do what I want. Uh, my evasiveness fell. Okay, Ember, there we go. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I legit don't even remember where to go in this game. I mean, I'm pretty sure I have to go downstairs, but... Like I said, I don't remember because it's been so long since I played Pokemon. <coughs> Well, at least since I played red and blue. I played black and white, obviously, but... But there was, uh, no amount of moon in there. Uh-oh. Oh, damn, I just realized one more level. My Charmander revolts into a Charmeleon. What up? Is there anything over here? Oh, God, these... Uh, these random battles are going to be the death of me, man. I swear. I'm sure you guys aren't enjoying this either. Like, anything to fix that, man. Um, okay, more dudes over here. Did you come to explore the cave too? Sure, I guess. Whatever. Youngster Josh. Alright. Well, I'll call it my Rattata. Boom. Take that. <coughs> uh, you want another one? Boom. Dead. Yeah, your Rattata sucks. Mine's better. Uh, 121. Another Rattata, really? Guess I'll keep my Rattata in. Why not? Oh, actually, I probably should have put my Charmander or my Pidgey in. To get them levels to evolve. Um, yeah, whatever. My Rattata is going to die soon anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, no way, Tail Whip. You could have killed me, but yeah, do a Tail Whip so I can kill you. Good call, Rattata. Good call. Actually, I can't really blame Rattata. I can blame his trainer. Good job, trainer. Nice, level 12. Rattata's leveling up quick, which is nice. Zubat. Alright, well, let's go with uh, Charmander then. Gets him to level up. <laughs> Boom. Done. Uh, oops, got distracted by attack message. Uh, it's that whole stupid thing I always talk about. <laughs> I swear I probably talk about this in every video about... Wait, why am I bat... Am I battling a random... Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <coughs> well, I might as well catch him, because he's all the way down here. Um... Saying it, it's it goes back to the stupid thing. I, okay, oops, to the uh, stupid thing I talk about in pretty much. I think I've talked about it in almost every video for the let's play is legit. No one will message me until I freaking start recording. Like it's one o'clock in the morning right now, 
I got out of work at five. Oh, it forms colonies in perpetually dark places. They use ultrasonic waves to identify and approach targets. Nice. Um, got out of work at five. No one texts me pretty much at all. Don't want to do anything. Whatever. Second, I start recording at one o'clock in the morning. 500 texts. Like, I mean, I'm sure you can hear my freaking phone vibrating. It's really, like, annoying. It's like, what? Like, stop. Stop. Well, you shocked me. You're just kidding. Okay. Geodude. Um, do I even have, what do I have, nice, who did I, what did I kill Brock with, oh yeah, Mankey, that's right, okay, I was gonna say, I was like, I need something that's weak against, or that rock's weak against, or ground, whatever they consider Geodude now anymore, I don't even know, ground rock, I'm sure he's both, uh, let's go with a low kick. <laughs> Super effective, nice. Yeah, he's just gonna keep defense curling instead of attacking. Good call, bro. Good call. Yeah, next time I go to... Once I get to Cerulean City, I'm <laughs> legit gonna buy like a hundred frickin' uh, repels. Just because I don't, I just want to. Not that I want to rush through this, but it's annoying when you fight. Have to fight 800 Zubats just to get to where you're going. Like it's a pain. It's a pain in the ass, you know. So it's great if you're trying to level up, but like I don't really need to level up right now. So it's just like annoying. Karate chop. Okay, done. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Nope. So yeah, whenever we get out of out of uh, this cave here and uh, get to Cerulean City, we shall call that a part. If I ever get out of here, apparently, <laughs> apparently it's gonna take me eight years because of all those freaking Zubats I have to fight, or not fight, but go into a battle with and then just run away from, like... Moonstone, nice, I can evolve my Clefairy. Uh, Zubat? Oh wow, Geodude, okay, still. I don't want you, go away. Go away. Let me wander this cave in peace, please. Ugh. Whoa, what a Paris! I didn't even know there are Paris is in here. Well, I'm gonna catch you then. I legit had no idea there are Paris in Mount Moon. Were there always Paris in Mount Moon? I really can't remember for the life of me. I'm not sure if they were rare, just really rare, and I never encountered one, or if this is something they added in Fire Red and Leaf Green. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below if you know. Actually, you really don't have to. I'll probably just look it up and figure it out, but... Oh, let's catch this Paris. Why not? Because he is part... He's part grass, right? That would help in this city. I think he is. I can't remember. He's either bug poison or grass. Whatever. Forest Pokemon. Burrows to suck tree roots. The mushrooms on his back grow by drawing nutrients from the bug host. Yeah, that's, um... I don't know if any of you know, but that's a pretty messed up, uh... There's a lot of messed up Pokedex entry. I mean, I'm sure you know about that, but, like... If you look at some of the Pokedex entries, a lot of them are messed up, man. Like, Paris and Parasect. Apparently, the mushrooms on its back are, um... Parasites. And... Oh, Team Rock. Jeez, I got a long way to go. A little kitchen to be messing around with grown-ups. Be bad news. Thanks, man. Um, 
But yeah, once if I think it's Parasex uh, Pokedex entry, it says that it's the Pokemon itself isn't alive anymore. It's the the mushroom parasite has fully taken over, and the Parasect body that you see is just a shell because the mushroom drained all the energy or fluid. I don't remember, but that's why. Like, Parasect has, like, those white eyes, because Parasect's pretty much just, like, a zombie, which is kind of creepy. Kind of messed up. You know? It's funny, because you think about, like, you think Pokemon's, like, a game targeted at kids, and I mean, it is, but, like, if you look at some of the, some of the stuff in here, some of the Pokedex entries are just really creepy and messed up. There's, um... I'm trying to think of some bad ones off the top of my head. But there's the one for... God, I don't even know what generation this Pokemon's in. It's four, I think. It's that Driftloon, the one that's like a balloon. But, um, apparently Driftloon, uh, will fly down and let little kids grab it, thinking it's a balloon. And then it kidnaps them and takes them away. Like, uh, what? Like, why? Why is, why is that in a kid's game? You trying to give kids nightmares? Like, I don't, I don't understand. Like, why would you have something like that in here? This is, like, weird. Well, there's the, then there's the famous Hypno one. Hypno, uh, hypnotizing children and kidnapping them. I'm surprised I honestly never noticed that as a kid. Probably because I didn't really read the, uh, Pokedex entries that in-depth. I kind of just like, was like, yeah, caught it, woo! And then just did whatever. I didn't really sit there and read everything. I was a kid, I didn't like to read, man. Who liked to read when you were a kid? No one. But, um... That's probably why I didn't remember that. I'm steamed. I don't even know what that means. Okay. Jeez, no. No, why? Alright, I already caught a Paris. I don't need it. Yeah, okay, so the Pokeball does appear up there. I guess we never caught a Geodude. I could have sworn we did. I must be going crazy, man. Uh, no, I can't walk more than like a minute without freaking fighting something. God, just let me out of this cave. It's all I want. Oh no! <coughs> I already caught a Clefairy. I don't need another one. Stop! Stop, please. Uh. Am I just going around a big circle? Oh no, okay, there's not a Team Rocket, dude. We Team Rocket shall find the fossils. Reviving Pokemon from them will earn us huge riches. Okay, man. Wonderful for you. Team Rocket Grunt would like to battle. <laughs> you know, I, th I, I think that's funny too, is that? I mean, I know in the show, obviously, Team Rocket's like a joke. But, um, in the game, Team Rocket's supposed to be more menacing, and they're like, you know, this big crime syndicate or whatever. They steal Pokemon all the time. Why, why are you using Rattatas? Why are you using level 13 Rattatas if you steal Pokemon and you're like this mega evil corporation? I think you should have better Pokemon than level, like, 13 Rattatas. I mean, that's just, just me, I don't know. Maybe get some, like, Gyarados, or some Dragonites, or Charizards, I don't know, man. Onyx, anything. Anything better than a freaking level 13 Rattata, like, why? Like, man, I'm intimidated by you with your freaking Rattata. I'm so scared. It's actually killing me, but it's kind of funny, but... I'm just saying, you know, you want to be more intimidating, you think you'd have higher, uh... Stronger Pokemon. Uh, God, I'm probably going to faint here. I actually have to go back to the Pokemon Center. Which is annoying. I don't know. I might not because my Pidgey and <coughs> Charmander are high enough, high, pretty high levels, but I don't know. Depends on how many more people I have to fight. I legit have no idea how far I am from getting out of this cave. Come on, 
Come on, Prime Mikey. Well, I call, almost called him Prime Ape. That would have been retarded of me. Uh, Alright, Mikey, 150. Nice. Player defeat Team Rocket Grunt. Ooh, Erg, now I'm mad. Okay. Well, you lost, so... Can't do anything about it now, man. Oh, we gotta be getting close. Here's the fossils. Hey, stop. I found these fossils. They're both mine. <laughs> Not if I have anything to say about it. Super Nerd Miguel. I always love that in these games. Some of the names they give these guys, like Super Nerd. <laughs> like, that's what he's defined as. Yeah, you know. My name's, uh, I'm just Super Nerd Miguel. What's going on? Yep. I'm a super nerd. Oh, poison gas. Great. Mankey's gonna die. Mankey, no! <coughs> you know, one more attacking? Yeah, Mankey. Nice. Nice way to stay alive, brother. And he's gonna die here, but it's okay. <sighs> you did well, Mankey. Return. Come back. Oh jeez, my Charmander's like got half health, I didn't realize that. That's kinda crappy. Well, hopefully... No! No, Charmander. God, no, why? Uh, this isn't good. This isn't good. No bueno. No bueno. I'm just going to keep Charmander in here because I can't risk getting him and Pidgey poisoned. That would be bad. He's going to have to stand and fight and tough it out until he dies. Come on, Charmander. <coughs> Come on. Don't don't get the kill from the poison here. You can do this. You can do this. No! Charmander! God! No. Uh, all right, Pidgey, it's all on you, man. You got this. Wow, that was the weakest quick attack I've ever seen in my life. Jeez. All right, Pidgey, come on. Come on. Oh yeah, Pidgeotto, what up? We just gotta beat this last guy. You got this, Pidgey. You got this. Oh boy, it's Voltorb. This could be bad. Please don't do any electric attacks. Please don't do any electric attacks. No. Oh no, he's charging. Okay, okay, good. Oh god, Pidgey, you gotta you gotta hurry. You gotta kill this guy. If he does an electric attack, you are done. And I will have to start this dungeon. Dungeon, I don't know why I said dungeon. I'll have to start this cave from the freaking very beginning. <coughs> and rewalk through all these freaking zoo bats. It'll be awful. Yeah, Pidgey, what up? Take that super nerd Miguel. Yeah, you better share. We'll each take a fossil. No being greedy. Uh, guess Pidgey doesn't evolve at 16? No, I don't want the Helix fossil. Dome fossil. Kabuto, what up? Alright, and this one's mine. Alright, whatever, man. I guess Pidgey doesn't evolve at 16. I could have sworn it was 16, but I guess not. Maybe it's 18. Or maybe because that was like a stupid event, it didn't evolve for some reason. I'd be really mad about that. That's just dumb. Uh, God, I gotta be close. Come on. Oh, good thing I found an antidote now. Oh, come on. I think I'm almost there. Yes! Woo! Sunlight! Alright, we're roof four. We just gotta make it to Cerulean City, and there's. There's these two dudes. Oh, uh, they teach you something, don't they? A kick of brutal ferocity. Mega kick is the ultimate attack. No. This guy's gonna teach me mega punch. <coughs> I can't teach it because my Mankey has fainted. So I will have to come back once I go to a Pokemon Center. Come on. Where's Cerulean City? It's gotta be close. Roar. Useless TM. That's what I wanna do. Scare Pokemon out of battle. I mean, I guess it's helpful when I'm getting chased by all the Zubats, but like... It's not very helpful in a real battle. Yes! We made it! Cerulean City! 
We made it, guys. Finally here. All right, we will heal up our Pokemon. Ding, 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 ding. We'll heal these boys up, and then we will call that a part. And then the next part, I guess, shall be the Cerulean Gym Battle. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Uh, we will like. If you like the video, subscribe if you're not already. And uh, like I said, thanks again for watching and stay tuned for more videos. Later.